Hey folks, this is a rant about online ordering versus buying in the stores. More and more these days, we're forced to order things online because our stores will not stock things like they used to. Remember the good old days when you used to be able to go to a Tower Records or a Sam Goody Record store or a Virgin Mega store? Oh, wait a minute, my neighbor's making noise, he's leaving. Okay, now I'll resume the video again. It's two rants in one. Hi folks, remember the good old days when you used to be able to go to record stores and you could just look at the shelves and you'd be able to pick your own personal copy of an album? Remember that? You'd go to Sam Goody or you'd go to Virgin Mega Store or go to Tower Records or any reputable store. And you had like several copies there, 10 to 20 copies. And you'd look for the perfect one, make sure that everything was clean, no rips or tears or anything. And you wouldn't have this either. You'd try to avoid copies like this that had a bent corner on it, okay? And this is what the bitch about in this particular video is for. Now, some of you may think, oh, what's the big deal, you know? It, I mean, look at this. It's a beautiful... Record Store Day copy of the Andromeda Strain soundtrack overall, and it's good. Except, what do you know? There's another dent that I didn't even notice originally. Yeah, it's another one. Um, and you say, what's the big deal? Well, because this kind of ruins it. That's why. It ruins how pristine it is. All right? Um, now, I'm going to tell you, this particular release, actually, my record store did get a copy of this in, but they had a ridiculous astronomical price gouge on it. They had it for... Uh, $65, which is way over overcharging. So I skipped it, and I, it's my own fault in this case because I elected to get it online, but that's neither here nor there. This is just giving me a, kind of a, a gripe in general about the idea of how these days most records that are kind of unusual, or most anything, whether it's movies on DVD or Blu-ray or books, you got to get them online because the damn stores won't stock them anymore. And I pine away for the good old days when you used to be able to get everything that you wanted. Uh, just there, pick your own copy, pristine. You're the judge, you're the one. Um, so I'm really aggravated by this crap, okay? And uh, that sucks, it's intolerable. I'm not going to send it back for that for that imperfection. Um, eh. Let's go back to the days when everything was stocked in the stores. All you people out there that say, oh, it's so much better today, so much more convenient. All I have to do is go online and go click, 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 and I get something sent to my house. Ha-ha. <laughs> yeah, you get it sent like this. And while I'm on the subject, I'm going to show you something else here. Okay, here's a nice box set of the Blu-ray edition, 50th anniversary of Ben-Hur, the movie. Um... I ordered this back in 2011, which was ironically before I started making these videos here on YouTube, and it was also a time when I ordered my Audio Technica turntable. Well, you know what they did? They set the Audio Technica turntable for the same day that they set the Ben Hur thing, and it was so heavy, the turntable, that this corner is nice here, but over here, they crushed the box. Again, not a big thing on this particular one, Look, at, but it just goes to show you what I've been saying all along. You know, that uh, I want these things in the stores where I can just simply pick my own copy right off the shelf that meets my standards. And not that I have to order them online. So anybody out there who thinks, oh boy, it's so much better. How much more convenient it is today. What a great 21st century. We order everything online. Don't have to go and show up in stores. Right to our service. Click, click on the keyboard. Yeah, well, you have to get that sometimes, randomly. And sometimes you have to get that. Okay, and whether or not that's uh, damaged in the mail, or whether or not, although I'm pretty sure it's not, uh, this is, the copies were just sent that way. There's nothing wrong with, with, with the boxes. It's the way people pack them and crap. That's the crap you get. For those of you who love rants, this was a ditty, a real good one.